Hi folks. I wanted to um, I wanted to do a little follow up today on the loose leash walking video that I did yesterday with this with this guy, Zeus, who is starting to become a little bit of a internet sensation. I'm getting uh, dozens, maybe maybe even as many as a hundred messages from folks that are really enjoying. Uh, Zeus's disposition and his uh, and his uh, camera readiness, I guess you could say. Anyway, uh, I when I did the video yesterday, there was uh, and I went back and I looked at it. Uh, there was something there that came that I noticed that I want to explain uh, for those of you that might be um, critical critical in your thinking. Um, You've heard me say in other in, in other videos that I've made, and I'm sure you've heard it from other trainers or read from in other books, that when you give a command to a dog, you tell the dog to sit, you should only say the command one time, a single time. If you say the command multiple times, what you're actually doing is you're teaching your dog that the command is not sit. You're teaching the dog that the command is sit, sit, sit. When I did the video yesterday and I was doing the least, loose leash walking, in the heel position, um, periodically you would hear me give that command several times. Let me give you an example of what I mean. We'll do it here. Zeus, heel, sit. What I'm going to do is I'm going to wait. I'm going to give the command as it's necessary. When I change direction, I'm going to give the command heel. If the dog loses his spot, I'm going to give the command heel. As the dog gets older and starts to understand both the command for the first time, my body language consistently throughout that entire walk, I will no longer have to do that. What I'm doing, what I'm going to be doing is giving multiple commands instead of the command multiple times. And there's a difference. Sit is the command. Sit, sit, sit is giving the command multiple times. When I say heal and I give that command again and again, what I'm doing is I'm reinforcing in my dog's mind just exactly what heel means that just because I turned to the left or turned to the right didn't mean that 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 command was over. I'm reinforcing that command. I'm giving the, the, the command a new command. I don't know if this I don't know if if, if I'm confusing people what, I, what I'm trying to explain here or not, but I think you might, you might be getting the message. Heel. Good boy. Heel. Heel. Good boy. Heel. See, Zeus wants to please. And like many dogs, especially young dogs, especially dogs that have a high desire to please like, like Zeus does, um, they need that reinforcement on that command so that they know that they're doing what you want them to do. Because they actually get... Um, depressed or dejected if uh, when they have a high uh, a level of wanting to please you they can become very depressed or de dejected um, when they think that they failed so you want to keep giving them the instruction keep teaching them what you need or what they need to know on on what you're doing also you may have heard me go i use a a, a, a click with my mouth versus the the little metal clickers um, i just prefer it that way and I do a good job with it. And you notice when I did it, Zeus was laying down. He got up and, and, and sat. I use that um, um, as a method to get their attention. Um, unlike what they teach you in the books or maybe what other trainers might be telling you, um, to use the clicker, what, what they basically say is click, reward, click, reward, click, reward. And I'm not, I'm not opposed to that. That's just not what I do. I'm not saying that they're wrong and I'm right or, 
or, or vice versa. It's just that this is the way I use that type of um, um, cue for my dog. So I click with my mouth, especially when I'm with a young dog and I'm teaching them and I want to keep their, their attention. Uh, I'll click with my mouth. And in fact, I will, uh, I will eventually drop giving the, the heel command multiple times, like I was just explaining. And then I'll just go with the clicking sound out of my mouth. I'll go from giving the heel command multiple times to then just giving the heel command once. And then if the dog loses its direction, then I'll start clicking instead of saying heel again. But right now with a young dog that's just learning this for the first time, I want them to understand the visual, the sound, everything. The other thing that I do, and I know I've, I've talked about it in another video, but maybe you haven't seen that, is I also try to teach my dogs that when I am leading with my left foot first, that that dog needs to follow with me. So there's, there's several commands that are given simultaneously. I might be clicking with my mouth. I might be saying the word heel. I might be leading with my left foot first, and I might even use this hand. You've, you've maybe seen me use my hand almost as a guide. Eventually, I should be able to take any dog without saying one word to them and just give either hand commands or body language commands that the dog understands. I'll give you an example of what I mean. Heel. Good boy. Sit. Good boy. Good boy. Now, I'm going to lead first with my right foot. Let's see if Zeus understands this or not. If he makes the mistake, that's actually a good thing because then I can reinforce it. Now, I have done this a couple of times with him, so I don't want to make it seem like this dog hasn't got a little idea of what I'm up to here. He does know that there's a difference between the left foot and the right foot. He just, I don't know if he's um, um, uh, linked it all together yet correctly. So if he does it right, great. If he doesn't do it right, that's great too because that's how I can teach him then uh, what is right versus wrong. Sit. Come on, Zeus. Good boy. Good boy. So the only verbal command that he got that time was just a that I gave with my mouth. Good boy, Zeus. We'll, uh, we'll call it quits on this video for now. Uh, we'll try to show off a little bit, see if Zeus does the right thing while I go and turn off the camera. Zeus, come. Good boy.